President Akufuado has charged the Ghana Immigration Service to work more seriously to combat illegal migration and its associated threats. The advice comes as government decides to open all of the country's borders in line with ECOWAS protocol on free movement of goods and services. The president was speaking at the Cadet Intake 9 graduation of the Ghana Immigration Service at Asin Fusu. The Ghana Immigration Service is a sole institution with a statutory mandate to regulate and monitor the entry, residence, employment and the exit of foreigners in the country. The passage of the Immigration Act expanded the functions and roles of the service to cover the facilitation of issuance of the indefinite residence and right of abode permits. At this year's Cadet Intake 9 graduation parade, the President Nana Kufuado was the reviewing officer. The newly graduated officers exhibited their skills with their smart turnout during the match passed in slow and quick time. In his address, President Akufuado noted that migration has been tied to global security within the threat of terrorism. He commended the security services for keeping the country safe in the face of global terrorism. He acknowledged that immigration has proven to be a strong developmental tool of many nations. The principal reasons for my journeys across West Africa since May are to renew friendships with our fellow ECOWAS member states, explore areas of cooperation, and reaffirm Ghana's commitment to the important process of regional and continental integration. It is for this reason that the government has taken the decision to open all our borders to operate for 24 hours. I wish to assure the Ghanaian people but our security agencies have been put on high alert and are coordinating effectively with our neighbors to keep our respective countries safe. So far, the Immigration Service has played a key role in this coordinated effort as it has provided critical and vital intelligence in addition to manning our borders rigorously during this period. Nonetheless, I'm informed that the 24-hour opening of our borders has also increased the spate of smuggling into our country. I urge you to be vigilant in assisting to combat this surge and help bring the perpetrators of these crimes to book. You know? 54 officers graduated with OCDT Yao Brobe Chairman Teng being adjudged the best in academics and the overall best graduating officer.